up guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another gyno advice video. Today uh, we're focusing on one particular stage of the recovery and that is getting your drains taken out. Now I'm going to admit going into surgery, moving into the recovery process, there was one thing that worried me the most and that was getting my drains taken out. I'd heard that it was the, the weirdest sensation. I'd heard it it, 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 it it was so weird that it even hurt. And I thought, you know what? That's not a sensation I'm looking forward to. And so it, it killed me. It really did, waiting, waiting for the surgery, knowing that eventually I'm gonna have to get these fucking drains taken out. And uh, not only did I worry about it for days upon days upon days, I actually pushed to get my drains taken out earlier than what they should have. Now the drains are there for a reason. They're there to drain blood away from the surgery site, <laughs> uh, which will then decrease the risk of complications post-surgery. They are there for a reason. They are extremely important. Not everyone's gonna get them out after a day. Not everyone's gonna get them out after two days or three days. Someone, if they're a really bad bleeder, for whatever reason, they might have them in for near on a week, okay? But it doesn't matter how long you've got them in for. You've still got to get them taken out and I'm here today to tell you face to face once and for all that you have absolutely nothing to worry about when it comes to taking the drains out. Don't even consider it. Don't even consider it. It doesn't it doesn't hurt. It doesn't feel like anything. It happens in an instant and I tell you what you've already gone through a bit of pain anyway through the surgery so taking your drains out ain't going to hurt one bit. It's going to be a relief. Uh, if you are having your drains out, I want to say congratulations because that because that means you've you've got through that first you know period of recovery. Uh, the bleeding has stopped. Be happy. Be happy. Be ecstatic that you're getting your drains taken out. But just know it's not going to hurt. So guys, that was probably my biggest. I'm going to say oversight when it comes to worrying about what might happen um, with the with the surgery and the recovery. You know if any. <laughs> I have actually, I, I'm, I have seen other people having different surgeries, having drains and having them taken out and I'm just thinking, it seems to be a, a common opinion, to be honest, that, well, it seems to be a common opinion with people who haven't had it done before, that this is going to be, you know, painful at the very least. And look, I'm here to tell you guys that it's not. You've got nothing to worry about and it'll all be over in an instant. So, there you have it. Another piece of advice from me to you. For free. I do still get, you know, thousands. I have got thousands. I don't still get thousands, but I have got thousands over the years. Thousands of messages from you guys out there asking me certain questions about the surgery. And I'm not going to lie, there have been a few that have asked about the drains. They've asked about drains. They've asked about how it feels. They've asked about how long they should have them in. Uh, certain guys haven't even had drains and they've asked me, you know, why don't I have drains? Those are questions for your surgeon. I'm no doctor. All I'm doing is giving you my opinions, my experiences, and my unbiased, unfiltered advice. And uh, if you like that, consider subscribing, like the video, stay cool, stay positive, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.